Hi, my name is Stephanie Harris, and I'm a Technical Application Specialist at Luminex Corporation. This is a quick tip on how to change the SDS unit to the sheath bottles on the Luminex 200 instrument. First, since we will be totally removing the SDS unit, you want to make sure you turn it off. Also turn off your analyzer and the XYP. Next, you want to disconnect the sheath tubings from the SDS. Also, disconnect the CAN bus cable from the SDS and the power cord. And then move the SDS to a safe place. Next, disconnect the tubing from the analyzer. There's a sheath waste bottle and a sheath bottle with the air connector and the sheath connector. Make sure to line up the tubings from the bottles to the wording and the connections on the analyzer. Waste. Air. And sheath. The next thing to do is to fill the bottle with one liter of fresh sheath. There is a fill line and we should not go anywhere past the fill line when adding sheath fluid. Now be sure to tighten the cap on the bottles and this will help pressure build. Now turn on the analyzer and the XYP. Once the software shows that the analyzer and the system is connected, we're gonna check the sheath pressure. Navigate to the maintenance page and commands and routines and run a prime. Once the prime starts, then navigate to the system info page and check the sheath pressure to make sure it falls within tolerance. You may need to regulate the sheath pressure if the pressure is too high or too low. Thank you for watching a quick tip on how to revert the Luminex SDS to sheath bottles. For more information and more videos, please visit www.luminexcourt.com.